Hello students, I welcome you all to the e-class at Kadaria. So, for past two weeks, we were discussing the topic of grammar, which holds the subtopic of parts of speech. As I said, there are eight parts of speech in this English grammar. Already we have discussed about noun and pronoun. Today we are going to discuss about verb and adjective. Verb. What is verb? A verb is a word that shows action. In other words, it just tells what the person or what someone is doing. For example, you can see here jumping girl. What the girl is doing? She is jumping. The baby sleeps. What the baby is doing? The baby is sleeping there. A man eats a burger. So, what the man is doing? He is eating a burger. Okay, so, verb is nothing but which tells what the noun is doing. As I said, noun is the name of your um, person, place, thing or animal. So, Verb is one which tells what the noun is doing. What is the action of the noun. So, the definition of a verb is a word that tells what someone or something does. An action, word or word of being. For example, sit, laugh, run, jump, dance, everything. So, the action done by someone is called to be as verb. For example, he is playing, he is running. So, everything, the action which we do is called to be as verb. So, let us see some examples of verb. See here, the first example. The children danced cheerfully. So, what the children are doing? They are dancing. Okay. So, in the next upcoming classes, we will see tenses which are closely related to verb. So, verb changes according to the tenses. So, let me teach you just the basics of verb. First of all, in these classes. So, here, the children danced cheerfully. So, the children are dancing cheerfully. So, here what the children are doing? They are dancing. Okay. And then the next example, the bell rings. What the bell? The bell can't ring by itself. It has to uh, be forced by someone. It has So, it has to be forced by someone to ring. Okay. So, the bell rings. So, the bell is ringing. What the bell is doing? It rings. Okay. And then the police arrested the thief. So what job will the police do? Or uh, Obviously, you would arrest the thief. So what he is doing? He's, he has arrested the thief. Okay. So the verb here is arrested. And then you can see a postman here. So usually what a postman will do? He used to deliver letters to the recipients in their houses okay so the postman delivers the letters so what he used to do he used to deliver that is give the letters he used to give the letters to the people see here the baby walks what the baby is doing it is walking there okay so the baby is walking there the birds fly together in groups. So, usually what is the work of birds? It can't sit simply in a place. Okay. It has to fly. Usually, most of the birds fly in groups. Most of the birds fly in groups. So, what the birds are doing there? They are flying. Okay. The word fly is a verb here. Next. As I said, we are going to see about adjective. 
what is adjective adjectives are words that describe nouns so you will get a little bit confusion between verb and adjectives no problem verb is nothing but the action of a noun whereas adjective is which describes a noun how verb means what what someone is doing and adjective is how someone is how he is okay so adjectives are words that describes a noun it tells how the noun looks smells sounds feels or tastes and also it tells how many okay for example how it looks so he is looking beautiful so the word beautiful the word beautiful is an adjective here so how he is looking he is looking beautiful smells okay rose smells sweet so how does the rose smell it smells sweet then sound he is making a noise he is making a noise so what he is doing how he does, how the noise is so that is what an adjective is and tells how many for example i bought three pencils yesterday okay here how many three pencils three pencils is an adjective here fine now let us also see the examples of adjective the sky looks cloudy today so the how the sky is looking it is looking cloudy okay you so saw the word cloudy is an adjective here then roses smell sweet so how the rose smells so it smells sweet he is a lazy boy so here the lazy boy lazy is an adjective lazy is an adjective that describes how the boy is mumbai is the busiest city so how Mum the mumbai city is so it is very very busy okay so the word busiest is an adjective so in adjective also there are many kinds of expressions many kinds of uh, degrees so we'll discuss it in the later on classes milk is white in color how the milk is what color it is or what uh, um, form it is so it describes how the milk is so milk is white in color so here the white is an adjective and then i ate four chapatis i ate four chapatis so how many chapatis i ate i ate four chapatis so here it tells how many so the word for here in the sentence is called to be as an adjective so go all today we have come to know that verbs or the words that tells something about a noun that tells what the noun is doing what action the noun is doing and adjective is that describes the noun how the noun is how the quality of noun is okay so today we have discussed about verb and adjective the next class we'll discuss more about other parts of speech and until then thank you for watching